Jesus, what's going on YouTube? How y'all doing, man? It's your boy Slayer. We're back with another Elemental Arc adventure. Sorry for the fact that I was stretching at the beginning of this recording. I didn't know when it was going to start, and I was stretching. So, um, as you can see, we're in the location where we left off last time, but do you see a major difference? We have absolutely freaking nothing. You want to know why? Because Thanos decided to snap his goddamn fingers and the server had to roll back because it broke and everything we accomplished during the first two episodes of Elements Arc got erased completely gone like basically it was like I just spawned in as a character and I had absolutely zero of anything so since those last two episodes and since all that happened I have been working my ass off to get set up to the point to where we can just continuously go out fail at taming and tame some amazing things and learn the ins and outs of elements arc all together without the whole boring dr you know drowning freaking weight of farming for resources building a base finding a base location and stuff like that so you can thank that else for snapping and breaking our arc server and having us restart but I hope y'all enjoyed the last videos and I hope y'all enjoyed this one as well. Please, please, please show some love. Like, comment, and subscribe, man. All that jargon. But anyways, all the links in the description, all the links to the server and all the community and all that stuff is in the description down below if y'all want to come hang out with us on Elemental Arc. It's public. It's open. Everybody's welcome. Just follow the rules and don't be a butthole. Anyways, let's go show off this base I spent freaking god for too many hours on. I hope y'all like this base. I just added a couple new things. So I'm going to show y'all around. This is our new home. Okay, we're going to show it off before we get into what we're really doing today. Welcome to our humble home. We have so many mods. On, we have 29 mods on this server and probably going to be 30 by the end of this video because I have to for damage numbers to cause to keep the lag down to a bare damn near minimum for people so we got our base so this is our little house this is from what is this from the eco from an eco mod it's just like little little highland houses i have not decorated yet so don't don't harp on me in the comments all we have is a bed and some some vaults but it's a little nice i like it makes it easier like if you're like those people like me who wants to separate their home from their like separate their bedrooms from their workshops and stuff so i mean it, it works out i just have to decorate and i'm so I, I i'm terrible at decorating so don't 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 get mad at me i'll show this off first this is what i just built before we started recording this will be our breeding big ass pin this is from the hg build mod the hanger stuff um, we're gonna do all of the got we have to, apparently we have to get gotchas based on what I've been told from the community members who have been playing on elements arc you need the gotchas for specific things so we're gonna go be doing that later today but this is gonna be basically our breeding pen we're breeding up as many big old tough donkeys as we can with all the new stuff and things but for the majority of it that's just like our breeding slash dino storage of what the dinos we actually need to have out so it's gonna be fun it's actually it actually fits which i'm actually surprised this is actually a metal cliff platform with metal cliff platform wedges from s plus with an hg electrical fence to make sure basically we don't fall off and our dinos don't fall off because i know i'm that retarded to where i would run off thinking like hey there's land there <laughs> but there's not we built our main workshop out of a little bit of castles and keeps for the roof and this front little wall piece right here and steampunk i grinded up for hours for all this steampunk stuff just so we can get this so we have steampunk hg s plus like mixture of damn near everything this is just our big old workshop really um so we're gonna play with a lot of things from steampunk i got a Regrind a lot of the materials because I wasted so much building this damn base But I mean hey, we got we got our multi tap forges To make things a lot easier that took forever our recycler the recycler is freaking Mint bro like this thing like it doesn't matter if you get like ascendant blueprints or ascendant 
things from drops or anything you know how like the grinder the s plus grinder or any grinder for that matter like gives you like 50 percent of the resources you spent well damn it the power recycler gives you everything back no matter how much it costs and it is butamous even though the s plus grind where's my s plus grinder even though this thing right here has helped me get to where i am this came in clutch towards the end so we got our our storage for all the resources that we've been doing now you can see i have a shit ton of resources you may be thinking how the flying hell did you get all those resources well while i was building this i started working on seed farm primarily because it's the only way to get real all the resources you want in abundance especially when you're solo and you don't have a team to uh, help you farm so i have been working non-stop these three buildings are are the greenhouse for for our tribe for us while we go on our elemental arc adventure i got every single craftable seed growing all the crystals are growing uh with three plots and everything else is in two plots per resource and man i haven't upgraded to like ascendant plots yet <clears throat> primarily because i don't want to go through this and have to redo everything because that's a pain in the butt so we're just going to be using the hg large tech crop plot gives 500 percent greenhouse it works and you know we got all of our stuff we got our crystal storage we got the hg composter which literally comes in clutch because of the auto distribution of the fertilizer as long as i keep getting fertilizer mixed up it collects everything from the plots and it distributes fertilizer. I love it. We have our gardener to pick up the seeds because we do need the seeds for stuff and things. That's how I made it this far. And all this other stuff. There's nothing really big. If you're wondering what the hell this is, it, it goes by the name, man. It's the poop maker. You put stem berries in there and it starts making large feces and it comes in handy whenever you're trying to make an abundance of fertilizer. We still are missing a couple of seeds, but we can't get those seeds until we defeat these freaking bosses here. And based on what I've been told, it's going to be a pain in the ass with the elemental arc dinos. And until I add the, the toggle on and off damage numbers mod to the server, it's very, very risky to use turrets to tame or to kill those dinos, those boss dinos, because it will crash you apparently. Huh, but yeah, this is our base, man. I hope I really do hope I did a good job with it. It's really something new. I kind of mixed everything in. Steampunk didn't have many options, and the snap points were really bad. That's why we kind of used the ceilings from the roofs from uh, castles and keeps. But I mean, I, I I think it turned out pretty damn nice. I really do. I really really do. So, but anyways, we got our house tour completed. Okay, completed now because i need a lot of like look at this look at this look at this look at hold on um rank okay, look i can't even make the really good arrows without essences and from what i like luminate it's all nature essence but based on what i've been told you need to tame the omni whatever the hell gotchas excuse me because that will give you they drop the more gotchas you have, the more chances of getting every single essence crystal essence drop from them, I guess. I don't know. So there's going to be a lot of taming of gotchas and we're going to start the breeding process and just get an abundance of a gotcha farm going. And if we need to like build an extension to our base, I will literally probably just open, like probably remove all of this, open up a portion of of like to get fence right here and literally build a floating island and at attach it to this platform just for a gotcha farm specifically like that's how intense apparently this mod is there's so much we have to learn and so much we have to do now we're gonna do the we're gonna do the cheeky easy route and omni you know what let's just do gotcha we're just gonna just go search gotcha we're gonna go tame as many as we can we know they're passive tame and they eat uh, a lot of different things so we're literally you know what we'll just start taming and we'll just keep moving down the list honestly okay so where is that wait where is that 
Where are you, gotcha? Okay, I need... Um, so it's right there. See, I could probably... I have an idea. Okay, let's see. So it's right here. The closest I can get is here. But let's just go here and just run the beach. See what happens. I mean, we're not looking for specific levels of gotchas. I mean, we're just literally taming any gotchas we can find. Whose base did I just spawn at? Oh, I'm in their shield. Well, you know what? That's kind of bullshit. Okay, um... Ab cave, ye old. What? Good, we'll just go to Red Obby and just run to the beach, because apparently I'm in somebody's base and there's tech shield. <laughs> Why it's open to public is beyond me. Alright, nope, 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 nope. Oh god, oh god. Just render? Hello? Okay, we got the... Okay, we're on the run. Okay, we're not on the run. We're running into trees. Okay, let's go. I... Uh, let's take bets to see how long it's going to take before I die trying to get to this gotcha. <laughs> like, I have such bad luck. Now, I have noticed that the elemental dinos um, are not all that strong. Wild, like wild dinos. And I would love to make them a little bit stronger to make them much more of a pain in the ass. But if I did that, you know, since I would config it that way, if I did that, then even the bosses from the seed farm would be even stronger. And that would cause uh, a lot of issues because even though the wild dinos are stronger, I would have to increase tame dinos to be stronger and then it'd just be a whole big cluster of a mess and it would be pointless. The only other way you could go about killing those seed farm bosses is turrets, but from weapons plus with the AP turrets, you know, if you know what those are. But everybody's like, add weapons plus. I'm not adding that to the server. Like, it's too cheeky. You can you can get the best dino in Elemental Arg, breed it up, get mutations, and literally just take an army to kill it. Oh god. Like you just gotta work with it. And there's, and if not, I mean, if the only reason why you're trying to get the kill the boss is for those, for that elemental seed or element seed, man, you know, you're just gonna have to take the, take the L, man. I mean, you need element for different things, but at the same, and hey, we have combat trainer. I mean, come on. There's so many ways to power up your damn dino. I mean, you're just gonna have to figure it out and get creative. How can I get to this damn gotcha? Is that a thing? Like, is that possible? And damn it, what the hell? I'm so lost. How the flying Christ did. Why, why, why am I making this difficult on myself thinking that that was the right way to go? Okay, okay, here we go. Level 600. So if I split all. How many does it take? 41. Well, that should work. I don't have owl pellet, so. This is the only thing I don't like about gotchas is that it takes so long to tame them. For the simple fact of how you tame gotchas. So while that one's being tamed, we're going to go. There'd be more around here. You would think at least. Ah, oh, Jesus Christ. Why? Why? Why am I that dumb? Why am I that dumb? Why? Just why? Okay, game, can you stop and let me, please? 
Okay, that gotcha's right there. Wait, I have an idea and I wonder if this will work. I don't know. But we're gonna try it. Okay, so while it's doing that, I'm gonna drop my inventory. Put it back in my... Why do I have... Where did I get this from? Huh? Can somebody explain to me how I have extra stuff in my inventory when I didn't kill anything? I don't I don't get it. I'm gonna do this while he's eating that I'm gonna do that and just drop a hold. Can you get off of me? There it goes. It's going up a little bit faster as long as this doesn't like spoil in the amount of time it takes to tame this thing. Oh! okay but look at these look at these guys man look at these freaking gotchas they look so cool but they look blind as a bat is that how all gotchas look or is this just elemental art because these gotchas have no eyes they're just i'm blind i can't see a thing then look at the designs like this is what i'm this is unique okay oh god okay that's one gotcha down Oh my god. Next! <laughs> We're just gonna go down. We're gonna see how many we can tame as fast as we can. Okay. You're oh you're good. You're good. Okay, just hey, hey. Madam. There you go. You just sat on it, but hey. Oh no, it's rolling. The motherfucker was rolling away. I do apologize if you don't like my cut cussing i'm trying to stop cussing but it's a work in progress go chase it chase it there you go we're literally just gonna run this beach and tame as many gotchas as we can without making this video long as hell okay um let's see let's try to get we got male and female so we can technically just breed these if we can't okay this one's like super super far we really oh look here's one Another female, sweet. Christ. Got him? Hey. Hi, madam. Eat this. No! Don't walk away. Shoot, where'd it go? Oh, there it is. Okay. I had to make sure like I found it because if I lost that I would have been screwed Oh look somebody's base I don't know who that is Okay Is there one more we can tame before we finish out our episode with our house tour and gotcha taming? <gasps> there we go There we go Look at this female Three females and one male bro We are going to be breeding up a gotcha farm bro Like come on now And this one's a good level too I don't know if I would use these to kill though like, I really don't know if I want to use them for, like, it's the only dino I have to kill stuff. So, if anything, we're going to do some testing with this uh, off, off. Can you stop? Get off of me. We're going to do some testing to see how much damage these guys really do. And if they are killers, we're going to breed up, breed us up a good killer. And we're going to use it to go tame some stuff. So, at least we don't die just on foot. Because I'm naked. I'm always naked because my armor always breaks. So, you know. What are you gonna do? What are you gonna do? Come on, there we go. All right, we got we got all of our gotchas that we need. I'm inside you, madam. That's gross. We got all the gotchas that we need. Let's go back to the house. I gotta before we end this episode, we're gonna figure something out because I've HG build mod allows you to shrink your dinos, so I wanna I don't know how to do it. So we're gonna find out. Okay, let's turn the creature deluxe finder thingy off. All right. Um, wow, they actually ate the majority of, they literally left me with six element. All right. So how are we gonna shrink these? Oh, it does it itself. 
Oh! No shot, bro! Okay! Oh, they still have the, the... Okay, I see what it is. It's like they shrunk. Oh, I'm gonna have to put this over here. At least I know they shrunk. Because that's all that really matters. Um, sir, gotcha. Why are you standing on my stuff? Um, I'm having I'm having technical issues. Okay, let's let's put them over here. See if we can't get them to line up for a, for a photo shoot for the ending of this episode. Um. You. What? Okay. Y'all are making things very difficult. Well, guys, anyways, fuck the photo shoot. <laughs> oh my gosh. Uh, well, we got our first gotchas. We're gonna, I'm gonna be in the background breeding these up. And the next, hopefully, in the next episode, we have a ton of gotcha babies and we can make some type of progress into taming some real elemental dinos for whatever type of progression this mod gives us. And I hope y'all enjoyed the video. Please make sure to share it with a friend. Help me grow this channel to reach 1,000 subscribers. And come by and check out the streams that I do, whether it's streaming ARK, streaming Call of Duty, whatever game we're streaming that day, come check us out. We'll be streaming on YouTube. Uh, we'll be streaming back on Twitch again. I am going back to Twitch. And we'll be doing possibly some multi-streams or picking which one we'll be streaming that day. Who knows? All the links are down in the description, or you can just check it on my profile. Um, I think there's like a button that says are these the links that you're looking for? Um, it's my flow page. It has my TikTok, YouTube, Twitch, Discord. It has everything you need And I believe it's in the description as well To come show your support on all my other social medias that, that I have and Maybe you'll see some other content outside of arc or outside of you know video games in general, especially on TikTok. I know you'll see that But besides that guys, I love y'all y'all keep smiling and y'all keep pushing to chasing your dreams. I'll catch y'all in the next one. Peace.